Hey, y'all. I was challenged, I think it was last week, to do a um, simply pretty look in under five minutes. So, I was slacking a little bit, but I wanted to hop on tonight and try to beat the challenge. Um, we have a collection that has four products in it, and a lot of days when I'm running late, and I know some of y'all probably do too, um, these quick little steps get me out the door fast. Um, so I want to show you what products I'm going to be using tonight, and I want to volunteer to time me. I probably should have brought my watch in here, but I want somebody to um, volunteer and see if I can make it five minutes or less. I'm going to try anyway. But I'm just going to do foundation. I'm not going to do my concealer, but I didn't take it out of my palette. I'm going to try foundation, one powder. Um, I'll probably use bronzer because if I'm going kind of quick, I may want a little bit of color. And I'm going to bump that up a little bit. Is that better? Yeah, I think I can see myself a little better. Um, I'm just going to do my bronzer and not my powder. That way I can get it on quick and it'll still set everything in place and give me some color. And then I'm going to do mascara and a lipstick and i think we've got several pretty lipstick colors but i like this color it's called well it's two, number 201 i think it's prim and proper but it gives you a little bit of color i was trying to decide on like this color or a nude so y'all time me and let's see if i can do it let's see okay and i wet my sponge already i usually use like a little wet blender so, I don't know how, who's going to time me? I don't know how, to, I don't have a clock with me or anything. Okay, y'all tell me if I make it or not. Here goes. I just do a quick little swipe in here. I'm just going to pat. And really, now that I got a new little blender that works pretty good, um, I can put it on a lot faster. I was just patting, but now I can kind of swipe and get it on pretty quickly too. And then I can go back and pat if I notice any areas look a little splotchy. And I love this foundation because it goes on, it has good coverage, but it goes on so smooth and it looks like my skin. It doesn't look cakey or it doesn't look like, I don't know, sometimes I see people's foundation and you can really tell that they have a lot of makeup on. This doesn't take a lot because it's got a lot of pigment to it. And it lasts forever. I love it. Alright, one step down. How much time did that take? Okay, I'm coming in with bronzer. Just do a little bit. Ooh. Give myself a little color on my forehead. And I always come in on my neck to give myself a little color too. Y'all, how much time have I used so far? And the great thing... Oh, I didn't bring an eyeshadow brush in here. But the great thing is you can use the bronzer too as eyeshadow. So with four steps, I'm going to get my whole face on. And it blends so well even with your finger. Put just a little bit more on. Blending that a little more. So now I've got some color. I'm going to come in with my One Step Fiber Mascara. Usually my mascara takes me the longest just because, I don't know, I pay a little more attention to it and I try, like, I usually stab myself in the eye or get it on, like, underneath my eye or on top of my eye because I'm going quick. So it's great, like, if y'all know me, I'm always running late, so I've been wearing this a lot lately.
And if I was taking more time and only wanted to use these steps, I can even use my mascara as my eyeliner with a brush. Because this stuff is water resistant, so it stays on pretty good. But I just feel like, to me, it looks put together. And my last step is lipstick. And that's it. Gives me a little color and I look alive. And didn't take long. So there you go, and I'd be out the door. Do y'all usually take a long time to do your makeup, or are you just like a quick slap it on a couple steps and run out the door? I've even seen a few people, I don't really ever have to do my eyebrows um, because they're pretty full on their own, but a lot of people even use the bronzer, um, or we've got a great eyeshadow, but they use the bronzer to fill in their eyebrows. And I was like, that's pretty awesome. You can do your cheeks, your eyes. You could really even add it to your lips and with your lipstick to change the color. You can do your brows. It just depends on how much time you have and how quick of a look you want to do. So I've enjoyed that and I think I beat it. Let's see. I can't tell how long I've been on here. Who's watching with me? Did I make my time? Did I do it in five minutes or less? I meant to bring a watch and I got started and realized I didn't bring it. <laughs> but that's what I've been doing lately. Just something quick, something fun. And I look put together. I don't look completely dead. So <laughs> anyway, thank y'all for hopping on. Um, and throw me some other challenges or ideas that y'all want to see. I'm having fun playing in, in some of my looks and makeup. And uh, I want to try to do some other looks. I did some Halloween looks a lot of people liked and I'm trying to figure out um, some other fun little challenges to bring to y'all. But anyway, y'all have a great night. Bye.